Top notch doctors here at the University of Kansas Health System have not been able to pinpoint what's causing the Smithville 15 year old's strange series of symptoms that have now left her permanently blind. The family just hoping by sharing her story that someone might have the answers they desperately seek. We do want to warn you some of the images in our story may be tough to watch. Jordan Walker enjoyed a family cruise last summer, but when she came back to the States, her medical nightmare began. It started with stomach pain and bloody stools. It just went haywire from there and everything started swelling. Doctors in North Carolina ran tests and sent her home thinking it was just a sinus infection. Ultimately, 15 year old Jordan lost her sense of taste and smell. That led to multiple specialist visits back home in Kansas City and tons of tests. And everything came back normal. The family was told it was a one in a million episode that probably would never happen again. But two weeks before Christmas this year, Jordan's medical mystery came back with a vengeance. My whole face just turned purple and bruised and giant with blood. It was terrifying to watch it happen all over again and knowing that we couldn't do anything about it. This time, Jordan went to the ER at the University of Kansas Hospital. She ended up in the pediatric intensive care, a 16-day hospitalization with more tests, medications, and two surgeries to reduce eye swelling followed. And doctors are still stumped. But there's no answers. There's nothing they can do. You feeling better? See. While the cause for her strange symptoms remains unsolved, the teen does have one new diagnosis, permanent blindness. She won't get a chance to drive or see her sisters get married like she wants so much. The skilled archer and budding journalist knows things won't ever be quite the same, but Jordan's outlook is determined and positive. I'm not going to let this stop me. The family is incredibly grateful for an outpouring of support. It makes you feel like you're not alone. Now they're hoping someone will help find answers to finally help Jordan heal. Jordan's family does now have an emergency medical kit that they can use should she ever experience these kinds of symptoms again. Her family is planning a trip to Rochester, Minnesota at the world-renowned Mayo Clinic, hoping to finally get their hands on some answers and a treatment plan. Kara Mashek, Fox 4 News.